Hi, I'm Kristen Knoll, a librarian here at Massanutten Regional Library. We so enjoyed sharing with you treasures from our vault last month during the Shenandoah Valley Archives Fair and National Archives Month that we thought, and before Thanksgiving, we would share with you a few more treasures from the vault. So let's talk turkey. Let's start with some recipes. First, we have the Virginia Cookbook, tested receipts carefully selected and compiled by the Lady Society of the Presbyterian Church of Harrisonburg, Virginia, published in 1907. I've marked for us today a recipe for roast turkey right here. Explains to you how to prepare the bird, including uh, sewing it back together after you've uh, taken all the yucky stuff out of the middle, how to prepare the giblets, a nice old-fashioned roast turkey. Moving forward in time a little bit, we have recipes from the Shenandoah Valley from the Harrisonburg branch of the American Association of University Women. This uh, edition was published in 1959, although we also have a few later editions as well. This cookbook has recipes featuring ingredients common in the Shenandoah Valley, including an entire section on apples and poultry. Here I've marked for us a Shenandoah turkey casserole. So um, once you've cooked your 1907 roast turkey, you can use your leftovers to make a 1959 turkey casserole. We also have a few cookbooks produced by local turkey growers, including Fresh Ways with Turkey from Shady Brook Farms, published around 1985, and this brochure called Ground Turkey Recipes from Wampler Longacre, which is probably also from the mid-1980s. Both of these companies were quite, quite big in the 1980s around here. One of my favorite recipes from this cookbook, just because of the name mostly, is called Turkey in the Straw, which looks like some sort of turkey noodle casserole, but it's just got a fun 1980s sort of name. Our vault collection also includes uh, a pamphlet file that contains newspaper clippings, brochures, and other local ephemera. This is a travel sort of brochure for Harrisonburg and Rockingham County, published around 1951. It's called Harrisonburg, Rockingham County, Turkey Capital of the East, a Land of Opportunity. I love down at the bottom here, it says a million turkeys dot Rockingham County, and has a picture of some of those turkeys here. I just think that's a fun one. Longtime residents of Rockingham County might remember the annual Rockingham Turkey Festival that was held each year from 1939 to 1997. Our collection contains these souvenir programs from the Turkey Festival from the first three years, 1939, 1940, and 1941. The, the Turkey Festival had lots of fun events like a turkey throw, turkey races, they crowned a queen, they had dances. So I just thought I would show you from the 1939 scrapbook here, or program rather, this is Ruth Wampler, the first ever queen of the Rockingham Turkey Festival. This brochure advertises the 1941 Turkey Festival. Uh, on the front here, you see a picture of the 1940 queen, who was actually the daughter of the Mexican ambassador to the United States. How she ended up in Rockingham County and the queen of the festival, I do not know, but that would be an interesting mystery to solve. Inside, it talks about all of the different events that go on, such as a um, evening processional, a dance, all kinds of fun events going on at the Rockingham Turkey Festival. So it was a big social event for the year. We have several other items in our collection related to the Turkey Festival, including a collection of scrapbooks compiled from 1967 to 1991 by the Virginia Poultry Federation. They contain pictures of different events, brochures, um, turkey producing statistics, all sorts of fun turkey facts in there. We also have this sign that says Rockingham County, Virginia, in heart of Shenandoah Valley, Fruit and Poultry Center, which we got with the donation of the um, programs that I showed you earlier, so we think it's probably from around that same mid-20th century period. But this just, you know, advertises some of our big crops around here. And then lastly, on uh, 16 millimeter film, we have um, images from the 1939 and 1940 t Turkey Festival. So these are actually, you know, moving images on the 16 millimeter film here. We have put it onto VHS um, so that if you want to come into the library and take a look at it, we do have a VHS player that you can see um, that version on, which is just copied from these original films. Unfortunately, we haven't digitized it yet, but hopefully we will get that done in the near future, and maybe that will be a special treat for you next Thanksgiving. I hope you enjoyed seeing all these turkey treasures from our vault here at MRL. I'm sorry for all of the foul language that I used today. Everyone here at Massanutten Regional Library hopes that you and your families have a safe and happy Thanksgiving. Enjoy your turkey!